SOLIDWORKS PDM, our product data management vault solution for SOLIDWORKS, is the perfect utility to keep everyone and everything organized in your office. But what if you can't be in your office? Does all work have to come to a stop if you can't connect to the vault, either locally or through a VPN? Well, luckily the answer to that is no, and I'd like to discuss a specific feature called offline mode so you can see how it works and so you can see what you could do with it, so you could prepare for your next trip or network disconnect. SolidWorks PDM Vault View is a folder on your hard drive that serves as both a local file cache, meaning files are saved there and opened directly from your local hard drive, as well as a view into the live vault, showing all files and metadata that are available to you. The server has every copy of that file available, but for each file you may or may not have a local cached copy. Any operation you do that requires a copy of the file will go ahead and trigger an automatic file download in the background. So you're going to get it if you don't have it basically every time you need it. So when you're online, the distinction between having a locally cached copy or not is basically meaningless because everything is going to work and the moment you need it, it'll cache a copy right away. Now this local file cache is specifically used because it's much faster to open and save files from your local drive than it is from working across a network. But there's another benefit here, which is when you're disconnected, you can still work with those local files. Let's say I want to work on this assembly, but I want to do it on an airplane or at an airport. I don't want to pay for the Wi-Fi because it's never going to be fast enough to save across. Here's how I would do it. I'd check out the assembly and any files that I know I need to make changes to. Like this Davit assembly, uh, the enclosure, I've got a ladder drawing in here I need to work on. Those will make sure that the latest versions of each of those files is loaded onto my hard drive, and any files that I check out and take ownership of will locally have write access, so I can make my changes. Now notice, I'm not working on all files inside the vault, so I don't have copies of everything. This pipe assembly, for example, doesn't have a local copy because I've never worked with it. Now with all the files that I need ready to go, I can go ahead and go to Tools, Work Offline. Windows Explorer will close when you go offline, and when you get back, the folders in the vault go from green to blue to indicate that everything is now offline. Any files that aren't local, they're gone, since we can't see the available files that we don't have copies of. Many of the typical functions of PDM are driven from the server, so they're not going to be available here, such as the bills of materials, contains, where used, searches, things like that. If you need that information, be for sure to run those reports and export them for your reference while you're offline. Let's open this assembly up from my offline vault view, like you would from any other folder, and we're going to make a changes to a few of the components. Now, even though I'm not connected to the server, it's going to maintain my permissions so I don't have any conflicts with my colleagues. SolidWorks will block me from making changes to files that I don't own, but it's going to allow me to make any changes on files that I checked out. So even though we're disconnected, I won't stumble over changes made by my colleagues. If I need to make a new file while I'm here, I can do that and save those files into the vault as usual. But normally, the vault would be aware of that file the moment you save it in there. But while you're offline, that vault add process is going to fail. So that'll have to be done later manually when we go back online. I'll show you that in a minute. So I'm done with any changes here, so I'll save and close. And only the changes to the read-only file are discarded. Just like during an online session, the files that I own, those changes are saved. To reconnect to the server, Again, go to the Tools menu and choose Work Online. Once reconnected, the folders will return to green and the modified files will be identified by the server as having been changed. Any files created during offline mode will need to be added manually, so go back and browse to that file that we created and right-click and Add to File Vault. Files that were modified offline can be published to the vault and the rest of the team by simply checking them in, just like normal. If you'd like to learn more about how SOLIDWORKS PDM can tame your file storage and collaboration activities, give us a call or visit our website at mlc-cad.com.